in this video we are going to discuss about carry bypass adder so consider a 4 bit block of uh, full adder uh, here um, uh, uh, for propagate signal p is nothing but a propagate uh, what is p p is a a x r b and uh, g g generators a b so in order to generate the carry we know that carry is equal to uh, a b plus uh, c into a x r b okay so this um, uh, consider this is your uh, um, uh, this is your c naught and this is your c1 and this is c2 and this is c3 okay so i can write uh, c naught is equal to a naught b naught plus c into a naught x r b naught okay so this is nothing but g naught plus c into p naught so you require uh, p naught g naught uh, and c in order to generate the sum and carry so what is sum uh, sum of sum of zero sum zero sum zero is equal to a a x r b x r c here it is a naught b naught c naught so what is a naught b naught p naught x r c okay so this is your uh, sum naught okay so if um, we know that if the propagate signal is high goes high whatever the c value whatever the c value it will goes to the c naught okay the similar condition is uh, valid for p1 if p1 is 1 means uh, c naught value is c1 if p2 is 1 means uh, c1 value is c2 if p3 is 1 is c2 value is c3 so what happens uh, if uh, p naught p1 p2 p3 is 1 whatever the c value will reach the output okay so I have given it to a, a multiplexer, 2 is to 1 multiplexer. If P0, P1, P2, P3 value is 1 means C value goes to the output. Okay. Otherwise it has to, it is same as a, a ripple carry add. So this is nothing but your uh, carry bypass add. Okay. So what is the condition? If, um, if P0, P1, P2, P3 is equal to 1 then uh, C uh, C uh, C uh, C 4 okay the C 4 value is equal to C so this is a condition if uh, that is not a case uh, it has to uh, flow through the normal operation uh, like a uh, uh, ripple carry adder so this is uh, this carry bypass adder is also called as carry skip adder okay so uh, let us assume that uh, we are going for instead of uh, 4 bit uh, 4 4 bit uh, I am going to implement for a uh, uh, this is for 4 bit right this is for 4 bit uh, uh, it ranges from 0 to 3 so let me assume if I am uh, if I am doing for uh, n is equal to 16 ok so n is equal to 16 so that is ranging from 0 to 15 so I am going to split uh, this into a 4 blocks ok so 4 blocks so m is uh, 4 that is 0 to uh, 3 okay so uh, i require four this similar blocks in order to implement the n is equal to 16 uh, bit adder okay so i have uh, used uh, nearly four blocks which ranges from 0 to 3 and this is from uh, 4 to 4 to uh, 7 and uh, this one is from uh, 8 to 8 to 12 and this one is from Sorry, 8 to 11 right 
8 to 11 and this one is from um, 12 to 15 ok so this is your sum 0 1 2 3 and this is 4 this is 4 5 6 7 and this is 8 9 10 11 and this is 12 13 14 and 15 ok so this is 4 5 6 7 and this is 8 9 10 11 and this is 12 13 14 and 15 ok so what is this this block represent a bypass ok T bypass and uh, this block represent a T setup ok so what is the longest path the longest path is starting from uh, bit 0 to and it will end uh, to sum 13 so this is your critical path that is T critical ok so it requires a T setup ok T setup and uh, the carry that is generated here has to pass here right so it has to pass from first stage second stage third stage and fourth stage so i have written t setup t setup plus m into t carry what is the value of m m is 4 right so 1 2 3 4 so it has to uh, reach m t carry after that it has to pass to the bypass uh, bypass uh, it has to reach to here right it has to reach here so how many bypasses are there one two three t bypass it has to pass through so uh, this is 16 n is 16 n is 16 m is 4 okay so uh, 16 by 4 is 4 4 minus 1 is 3 so it has to pass three bypass okay 3 T bypass 1, 2 and 3 3 bypass ok so after that it has to go through the uh, ripple carry error stage what is the ripple carry error stage 1, 2, 3 3 carry ok so M minus 1 is 3 3 T carry followed by 1 sum T sum so this is your uh, critical path for the carry by password so it has to start from here T setup and it has to go through this uh, uh, this path followed by the bypass ok and it has to go through um, 1 2 3 followed by T sum. So, this is your um, critical path. Okay. So, here uh, T setup is the fixed overhead time to create a generate and propagate signal and uh, T bypass is a propagation delay through the bypass multiplexer of a single stage and T sum is the time to generate the sum of the final stage and T carry is the propagation delay through a single bit. The worst case carry propagation delay through a single stage of M bit is approximately M times a carry. Okay. So the optimal number of the bits per uh, skip block is determined by the technological parameters such as uh, the extra delay of uh, bypass selecting multiplexer, buffering requirement in the carry chain and the ratio of the delay through the ripple and bypass path. So I hope uh, this video is uh, useful for you. Uh, thank you very much.